This video describes how to fill our universal 700 mil cartridges. Filling and using these cartridges is easy as long as you are prepared before you begin and follow the instructions carefully. More information is at inkjetmall.com and community.inkjetmall.com. You should have a set of instructions a needle that you don't need, a 700 mil cartridge, a bottle of ink, a large syringe, a fill funnel, a priming tip, gloves, a sharpie, scissors, and a roll of paper towel. Put on your gloves. Remove the orange plug from the air inlet port of the cartridge. Select the correct bottle of ink and shake it gently. Unscrew the top and open the bottle by removing the silicone plug. Place the cartridge vertically, ink outlet down, fill hole up. Remove the silicone plug from the fill hole. Insert the fill funnel, support the funnel and the cartridge with one hand. Pour ink with the other hand slowly into the funnel. We normally recommend that you pour the ink into the cartridge until the ink level is just below the fill hole, about one half centimeter or so. This will give you a good 700 mil of ink in the cartridge. However, if you are only wishing to fill this cartridge with 350 milliliters of ink, pour the entire 350 milliliter bottle of ink into the cartridge at this point. Filling with less than 700 milliliters will require more priming to remove the air and will also require the correct chip, a 350 milliliter chip, or extreme vigilance on the part of the user so as not to run the ink cartridge dry. Filling with 700 mil of ink and using a 350 mil chip is safe. Remove the funnel and insert the fill plug back into its hole. This should be firmly pressed into the hole so it is totally inserted. This ensures that no pressurized air leaks out of the cartridge when in operation. Write the ink color or shade on the back of your cartridge above the fill hole plug with a sharpie. This is important to remember to do. Take a syringe and place the slip tip priming end on it. Now place the cartridge vertically, fill hole down, outlet up. Now insert the syringe into the cartridge ink outlet and angle the cartridge about 10 degrees to the left. Draw the syringe up. You will see a lot of ink foam come out. Once you see ink flowing, rotate the cartridge by 180 degrees. Insert the priming syringe again and pull a bit of ink out. This will remove any remaining air that was inside of the ink cartridge. Take your priming syringe and eject the excess ink back into your ink bottle.
For the cartridge in front of you that is Sharpie marked with its shade or color, find the correct chip and place it in the front of the cartridge. Take your thumb and firmly press the edge of the chip base plate down. You will hear a snap as the base plate is locked into place. Remove the chip from its envelope. Take your chip and place the front groove onto the base plate groove post and the back hole over the base plate hole post. Tape over the back of the chip to secure it in place to the cartridge. Although this is not necessary for good functionality, it ensures the chip does not fly off when you agitate the ink cartridge in weeks and months to come. At this point, the ink cartridge is ready to be inserted into your printer. The SureColor printers come with one-time chips. That means you need a new chip after the cartridge is empty. For all other printers, resettable chips are available. To reset the chip, place the resetter against the cartridge chip using the guides shown in the video. The resetter light will flash red several times, then turn solid green to indicate the reset is complete. More information and support for this product can be found at inkjetmall.com and community.inkjetmall.com.